Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I will show you some methods to fix black screen issue on Roku devices. So, the first thing we can do is try clear cache the Roku device. To do this, just unplug the power cord, and wait about 2 minutes, and then plug it in again. Let's do this on Roku device and also TV. Besides, please disconnect any peripheral attached to your TV, such as a soundbar, headset, etc. After that, if the problem persists, then make sure the TV is on the correct input. The Roku attaches to one of the HDMI ports on your TV, so the only way to use it is by directing the TV to the right source via the input, source button on your TV remote. For example, HDMI 1 or HDMI 2. Next, try change to another the HDMI ports on your TV. For example, if you are using HDMI 1, Try switching to HDMI 2 and vice versa. After that, use the TV's remote and select the corresponding source. If still not working, then try a different HDMI cable. Try this to avoid the case the HDMI cable could be damaged. Try using the Roku on a different TV, if possible. If that doesn't work, then the Roku itself, in all likelihood, needs to be replaced, or contact Roku to see about returning it. If it works on the other TV, at this point, you've confirmed the Roku works, but your TV doesn't. In case the Roku has sound but no image, there might be an issue with how the device is dealing with resolution settings with your TV. Try changing one of the image settings on your TV, using the TV remote like turning the overscan on, off, or adjusting the zoom level. If there's a picture after doing so, change the resolution on the Roku to anything else. For example, first, try auto-detect if that's not already chosen. If that doesn't work, try 720p TV. Play around with these options until one of them works. Finally, factory reset Roku device is the last resort you can take at this time. Just press and hold the reset button, located on the back of the TV, until the TV shows a recovery screen, press and hold for about 30 seconds. Once the recovery screen is shown, follow the prompts displayed on the screen, to connect to your wireless network. After connecting to your wireless network, the TV should perform a firmware update and reboot to home screen successfully. If this problem does not go away, the device's hardware is most likely damaged. Therefore, you need to bring it to the shop for repair. That's it guys. If you have any further questions, please feel free to get in touch or leave a comment. Thanks.